Hi, I am uh, Dr. Vikas Tandon. I am a consultant spine surgeon at uh, Indian Spine Energy Center and I've been working here since 2007. It's almost going to be 16 years now since I've been working here as a consultant spine surgeon. Okay, I am going to speak on spinal trauma reconstruction. So before I start with spinal trauma reconstruction, I think it is important to understand what is spine trauma. Uh, as we all know that spine is composed of 33 bones which combine to form the spinal column for us and it carries a very vital part of our uh, well-being or, or our movement that is the spinal cord which originates from the brain and travels through that canal and goes all the way till the coccyx or the tailbone. Now depending on where the fracture or the injury happens uh, in the spine, the patient may land up with various degrees of uh, uh, weaknesses it could be a permanent damage it could be a temporary damage again depending on uh, how bad has been the trauma so uh, based on this uh, based on the presentation of the patient these patients are usually classified into AIS categories that is the Asia category and uh, wherein the Asia A category is the one where there is complete injury to the cord because of a spinal fracture uh, wherein the lower part or the uh, or the lower part which is below the level of injury does not have any movement does not have any sensation and there is no perianal sensation that is there is no sensation at the perianal region so this signifies a, a complete injury to the cord wherein when a patient has some movement or even though there are no wounds but there are some there is some sacral sparing or there is some perianal sensation these are incomplete injuries now all these injuries wherein a fracture is there and there is a neurological involvement it means that the spinal column has been damaged and that needs to be reconstructed now reconstruction is very important when we deal with spinal trauma because we need to rehabilitate this patient we have to make them up and about as as soon as possible depending upon upon their uh, pre-operative uh, neurology or otherwise even if the patient has Asia A injury which is a complete injury and the patient is immobile still sometimes surgery is required so as to assist in our rehabilitation process. So uh, spinal reconstruction is basically a surgery which involves fixation of the spine with the help of instrumentation or with pedicle screws or with other 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 form of instrumentation which are available in the market to stabilize the spine at the same time which, which, which can be added with a decompression so as to provide a healing environment for the cord. Thank you so much.